All right, y'all. What is the word? What is the word? What is the word? Speeding of building. Back when that episode of Internet was, and today we talking about this nigga Mike Wang, bro. For some odd reason, y'all don't understand that everything in this yin is because of the dust. You know what I'm saying, and it's crazy. Time of debating on shooting. Please read. I'm gonna share this real quick. No one wants the game to be NBA live, but also the average working person doesn't want to come home and start basic stuff. Shooting wide open, corner shot, and be tough. Dudes lying say they want cop in reality. They want 2K to help them for not playing defense, which isn't true. How are we arguing this, this shooting should be hard. No shot contest. Need work. That's kept. And defensive change of direction should be intuitive. That's a fact, which he never done. This is five months ago, by the way, at release. We have to pick jumpers based on stats. We used, when we used to be able to pick, you, know, you mean, based on how they look. Now I'm forcing this science to shot stability, shot height, defensive immunity is too much and it isn't fun. 2K is mean way too much in this comp thing. Yeah, they, they, y'all don't even know the difference between bums, trash, I mean, comp, casuals. Y'all don't even know the difference between that terminology. You know what I'm saying 2K 14 PS4 written easily the best 2K I've ever played. I hope. You know what? Um. So we won't go back to. You know what I'm saying he need the one piece drawn. But now shooting is like like what what did that mean? You know what I'm saying this community is the reason why devs are hesitant to have any type of communication. They're scared of the community. It's crazy. We don't tune the game for the top five percent, but we do need to consider them. We regularly analyze suing across all users and modes. That's that's a lie. And despite what some think, stats are pretty close to the desired targets. Playing that online was definitely trending way too high, 47, three point percent, which is why it was adjusted today. What and you see this wrong guy? N- negative 13. Negative 13. What? What? Mike Wang said this. Yeah, Mike. Hold on, hold on. Let's see. So that says it was deleted, right? Yeah, Mike. Sorry. I, along with every human that has ever existed, is less consistent than math. But in all seriousness, I just want to hop on and play best, but in a long day for an hour or so. You know what I mean? And then even if you do practice for multiple hours a day, you're still not going to make the shots like you should. Even never listen. It's like trying to turn two cannons sh- into a looter shooter. Someone who actually works on this every day. I know you have to work on a video game to achieve a specific body type of my player. That's not, oh, I guess maybe a next gen. It's not even that for me. It's that he makes some stuff look smart with the punchline when in reality. Feel like consistency doesn't that math. Exactly, I'm saying. So people been had an issue with this. People been had an issue with everything that Mike Wang has been talking about. Got damn 2K. It sounds simple, but we tested internally with even marginally larger green windows, and our best players literally could not miss. Why would they miss? It's a fucking game. Your best players aren't supposed to be missing wide open shots. What are you talking about? Even watching Twitch streams, it's easy to see that there's at least a couple of players who are shooting 70% or higher from three in most games. You're talking about standstill jump shots. Wide open standstill jump shots. I ain't trying to hear that. If we lower the shot time and skill, it's not that. It's not the fact that you're lowering the jump, the shot time and skills gap. And then at that, you're saying if we lower the shot time and skill gap to accommodate more people, the game quickly turns into NBA Jam for more higher. And that's what do you? That's exactly what it is, though. This is NBA Jam. Everybody's dunking the ball on four or five people. They're dunking on their own teammates, including the entire other team. This is NBA Jam. What are you talking about? This is what it really all boils down to. If anyone has any ideas for a better option than these two, I'd love to hear them. Keep your green windows, no RNG, which means for the sake of balance, the windows need to be pretty small like they are now so that good players don't shoot. You don't you don't want good players to shoot 80 or 90 percent from three what you 
you don't want good players to shoot 80 or 90 if they're a good player they should be shooting 80 90 percent in a video game I'm, I'm the best shooter on here i shoot 90 percent from three why are you mad at that go back to bigger green windows that are easier for most people to hit but kept the excellent shot time boost reintroduce rng keep the game balanced it's not balanced though because that you're only talking about one aspect of the game what about the rim runners who's not going to care about shooting like what are you talking about this is what i'm saying and this was six months ago bro green windows are smaller in prime and any up compared to wreck and park like why would you do that i get why but like the shooting is already terrible and this is only for shooting he's only talking about that's he has he doesn't care about the fact that your entire meter is green when you're laying the bar the, the ball up when you're laying the ball up you should have to time that too What's the point of having shot timing for layups if you don't have to time your layups? That don't make sense. There were only three perimeter shooting related changes. And there were no changes for layups or interior scoring, period. Some shots were reporting wide open when they were supposed to be open. No. If it's wide open, it's wide open. The shots that are open now, you're saying like it don't make sense. The shots that are open should be wide open. I don't get it. This is what I'm saying. Because wide open frequency went down a little wide open windows were giving a small buff in all modes except primary that's cat deep threes were giving a small buff of high rated shooters and here's the thing i hit more limitless range jump shot well limitless range hop jumpers than regular three-point hop jumpers like right, sometimes i'm like yo i gotta shoot a bit from limitless because i get a bigger green window On Hall of Fame, Wreck and Park, the green window is pure and there is no RNG. That's cat. That's cat. Explain how people with full meters is missing and this is what I'm saying. And this is six months ago and I can still debate this six months later. Hold on, what is, what is not green? Why isn't it green though? He said, he said, he said, he said, Kendra is right, but, but why isn't it green? That, that, that still don't, still don't explain. Still don't explain the situation. Still didn't explain. That still don't explain. That still don't explain. That still don't make sense. Still don't make sense. Still don't make sense. Still don't make. It still don't answer the question. This is what I'm saying. This is why you're scared to communicate because you don't know how to answer the question the right fucking way. Man, why don't you just like? Like, what's up with Mike Wayne? Let me see. Let me see some. Let's see something. Let's see something. Let's see some. Oh, this is on thing. The fuck out of here, bro. Hate that shit so fucking much. I just say, can't wait to see Mike Wayne fire soon. Yeah, he still hasn't been fired. Still hasn't been fired. Let me see where the tool is at, right? Uh, anytime. It was in the past month. I need to see some. 
I wish Mike Wayne never did this shooting, but what do you mean? This, this shooting is simply too easy. No, it's not. No, it's not. Like, who the fuck? That don't make sense. You saying shooting is too easy. You never said nothing about layups being too easy. This is what I'm saying. Why does everybody complain about shooting and never complain about anything else? Just don't make no sense. What, like everybody just complain about people who want to shoot the ball. Why do you just want to rim run? Why do you just want to score two points? Because you don't want to learn your jumper. You're going to get mad at the people who take the time out they did they, they, they do. It's crazy. Game developer continues to mock the play piece. Ronnie is a community manager and has no input. Where's the developer that made me? It amazes me how teenagers with no real income think they're the player they still. We are. Well, I'm not a teenager, but I yeah, mean, they 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 have always been the player base. You think you think you think a grown ass man, look having grown up with this franchise since 1999, I'm absolutely positive 2K isn't really aiming at kids; it's aiming at their parents and their wallets. You're stuck in 1999, Jack Marley. He's clearly a white, a white guy who, who, who just, you know what I'm saying, gives a fuck about, you know what I'm saying, it ain't for kids, it's for private from kids. I hope you know that. I don't even know how to break this down to you because, like, you're you're stuck 30 years ago. Like, you know what I'm saying. You have you have a, a mindset from three decades ago. If they're aiming at the older players that don't play their game, why would they aim for you? And you're not going to be spending that much. The kids are using their parents' money, of course, but the kids have to play the game. Once the kids stop asking their parents for money for VC, then what? Which is what they did. Now they're down 100 million. 100 million. The gameplay is designed for folks who get the rich history of basketball. No, it's not. Not this Curry gen. Why are you hating on Curry? That's why the Curry kids feel like game breakers when they get to glitching and tweaking the game. And you want to sit there. And not time your post hook with a green window that's bigger than every shot in the game for two points. And a lot of builds would be a lot more viable if they weren't breaking the game. Like the real Curry, actually, there's only one of him in real life. And this is a video game. If everybody wants to make Steph Curry in a video game, there's going to be more than one Steph Curry. And I mean, like, you got Curry, you got Luka, you got... Dame, I'm saying like it's a, it's a couple Curry. You got Curry kids that is influencing the entire generation, and then it's like, was Curry in the interview? Did he not say that he was influenced by AI, just like everybody from his era? So it's like, how you hating on Curry when 1999 wasn't AI on the first two K? So how you hating on Curry? But you dick riding a game that AI was on the cover. This is why these old ass niggas don't make no sense. Like I'm saying, like you, you, you can't respect niggas like this. This is what I'm saying. But 2K players have to start thinking like Tony Stark, not Spider Man. What does that even mean? Spend the money and have fun with it. You can't have fun with the game though. If you want to shoot, but you got old heads saying, "No, oh, bro, you're not gonna be able to shoot. I don't care how much money you put into the game. It don't make sense." If you mean to tell me I'm 6'10 and can't get clamps, and that's thinking like Tony Stark, I don't get it. Because doing the same job as a broke kid is just harder and more tragic in my opinion. That's why certain complaints aren't ever heard. 2K doesn't care what broke kids want, but what about 
the broke kids that have their parents' money to spend in their all of their Christmas money on 2K. Not really. It just uses them to get to their parents. But their parents aren't playing the game. First off, you're talking about the player base, right? You're, I thought you were talking about the player base. It seems as if you're the only parent that's playing the game. It seems like you're the only parent that's playing the game. Because all of the other parents are spending money on for their kids to play the game. You're not spending your money for the kids to play a game. So, Mr. Jack Marley, um, you kind of like contradicting yourself just within this. And I think this is the reason why none of our stuff is heard. Because people like you, like Mike Wang, who's stuck in a 30-year-old mindset, who feel as though just because they're talking a lot means that they're making sense. When in actuality, when you reconsider what you said, it's absolutely like... Blasphemous. The actual player base is a 30-year-old guy who doesn't mind a microtransaction as much as he hates the costumes, dances, open word, and presentation. That stuff makes his kid ask him for twenty dollars, so it's in the game. But if that's the case, if the actual player base is a 30-year-old guy who um you know what I'm saying either lives in his mom's basement or you know I'm saying has a couple of kids. And has to give all their like I mean your their kids are spending more money on the game than you are. You know what I'm saying? So if there's one of you and then three, or even if there's just one of your kids, you know what I'm saying? They're getting more money out of the child. So they rather appeal to the kid that has costume dances, open world, and presentation. So as much as you hate that, you know what I mean? That 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 literally means that they're appealing to the kid. Because the actual base player is not a 30 year old guy. That's crazy. Why would they be? Nobody's making a game for a 30 year old man. Nobody. I promise you, nobody is. You know what I'm saying? You guys look this like for 18 and up. But they're not really appealing for the people that's 18 and up. They want to build to the people that's going to spend some money. You 30 years old, you got bills, you got rent, you got to give money to your kids, you got to you mean, pay a car note. What makes you think you're going to be able to? You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't. But this is the way, this is a 30-year-old mindset, though. Like I said, it's a 30-year-old mindset. There's more kids to play 2K, sure. I get it. So those 20s add up. But it's more than $20. If you think you're just... All right, so let's say let's say, let's say, say a couple days out of the month, you get your son $20. What about on Christmas? How much money is he getting from everybody? Like I'm saying, this is the 30-year-old mindset. The one-dimensional, retarded, think I know everything. Let me be... I'm saying closed minded instead of trying to actually understand what's going on. But there's more of those that would. So we're not we're not talking about so you're speaking in theory. Would it should have would have could have theory. That's not reality. Let's mention let's you I mean you're 30 years old still speaking in in in, in theory, you know what I'm saying? So there's more of those that would play the game more regularly if we could have an adult swim experience. What does that mean? This is an NBA game. And none of us care that a bill costs a hundred dollars. It's actually more than a hundred dollars. A bottle of Jack in a week and a week also costs a hundred dollars. I get paid on Friday. Sounds like a fun time for two hundred dollars to me. Sounds like lonely time. What a bottle of Jack to drown your sorrows, some weed to ease the pain, and then you got the shittiest game known to man for the whole weekend. So not only did two K get your money. Now your son got your money, the weed man got your money, the liquor store got your money, and you sitting on your edge drinking, smoking, playing 2K all day. I don't even do that. And I don't work. You talking about take your money. Capitalism. And and you really thought the typing on it like bro, you edited this and you never alright bro. Ronnie and Mike are doing Scott are doing God's work. Most of the 2K community are nasty, immature, and lack emotional awareness. So you want niggas to appeal to their feelings, nigga? Fuck their feelings. They want our money, right? That's all they want is business. It ain't personal, but they making it personal when they're you mean destroying the game. So what are you talking about? They belong to a system designed by greed and poor financial decision making and let them burn in their bliss. You don't have to be part of the pain. 
it's not bliss it's not bliss they're doing that on purpose they know what they're doing this is what i'm saying why is it that the retiring ass niggas like this to be having a voice remember when you could level up your player after every game by earning skill points oh that's when you was playing offline they had vc back then you ain't even know if you plugged in if you if you had internet at the time you would get vc during 2k12 dumbass nigga right mike wayne and 2k are beyond greedy definitely 2k24 is my last 2k 2k23 really should have been your last 2k for for who cares about the monetization y'all niggas complaining about the wrong shit this is why i don't understand why i listen to reddit niggas all they want to do is argue with each other reddit is literally the worst community known to man they got the nerve to call 2k community toxic how how and then you got there saying mike wayne can burn the hell no mike wayne better fix the game first ronnie is a community manager had no input on gameplay and microtransactions that's not what he said mike wayne is a gameplay director and doesn't have a say in the prices of microtransactions so 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 mike wayne has input on the gameplay the community manager does what promote you don't do a very good job at that Tuki's parent company take two is uniquely responsible for the overpriced content but we're over here complaining about the gameplay and how he's mocking the player base so if he's a community manager and he's mocking the player base that means you completely missed the point you see how smart people think they are you mean to tell me you have all of that knowledge and you didn't decide to take that into account that damn the community manager is mocking their player base man i've been on 23 with cave for the ball edition at 20 dollars only play my nba now so i'll be replaying this one wow the gameplay is the best been in new gen i mean probably if you playing like offline and shit like that you did so you playing my nba so i mean you know the microtransaction are going in my team i'm not even spreading the free 50 kv show or anything because You see these dumbass niggas, uh, this is what I'm saying. This is like, you, you completely missed the point. Y'all don't know what to talk about, but this got 682 upvotes and 171 comments because y'all bitch ass niggas don't know what the fuck y'all speaking on, bruh. It's just crazy. 540k members and 208 is online right now. And the top 1%, in order to be in the top 1%, all you need to do is have 208 members online. It's a crazy one. I'm saying, but that's gonna be that. You know I'm saying, uh, appreciate y'all tapping that, man. <sighs> Point is, the game is dog shit, and not gonna be able to fix it because y'all don't know what's wrong with the game. Then the people that do know what's wrong with the game aren't gonna be heard because people assume that they're not spending money on the game. I don't know about y'all, but I don't throw a couple dollars at the game. I'm finna catch y'all on the flip though, man. Speed out.